Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys all the stuff that I picked up for Laith. Laith starts preschool in two weeks and I'm super excited but also a little bit sad because this is like official. He's going to school and he's going to be like learning things and growing up and talking back really soon. Not to say he hasn't started talking back already, but I still am pretty excited and you guys know I love fashion and clothing and I just kind of, I feel like I went a little bit overboard um, with all the stuff that I got for him. So this is everything that I've purchased. This is not everything that he owns and even then it's still a lot. So Leith is starting a Montessori preschool uh, on September 4th and we have his home visit coming up actually in five days, which is also very nerve wracking. It's where his teacher comes over and she kind of observes him in his element and she looks at the toys that he's playing with and stuff like that. If you guys have been following me on Instagram, then you know that I've been having a bit of a struggle filming with Leith. So my sister-in-law graciously kind of offered to take him out of the house for a bit and that just gave me some free time to film a video and also it gives me a bit of peace and quiet as well because life has not been very easy lately i'm currently trying to wean him uh, from breastfeeding and it's been very difficult so let's just go right in and get started the first thing that i have here um, is from old navy i got quite a few pieces from old navy they are really good for basics and i came across this mustard vest Zara has something very, very similar, but I didn't really like that one because it had like writing on the neckline and I just wanted something really simple. So I picked this one up and right now I would say Leith is tall for his age, but he's very tiny, like he's skinny. So I picked this up in 18 to 24, but to be quite honest with you, 12 to 18 actually is just now fitting him perfectly. But I wanted him to kind of grow into this a little and plus our winters are like six months long here so you want to get something on the baggier side so like when he's layering um you can put this on top so i got this at old navy i believe it was maybe 19 or 20 dollars and i thought it was a really good price super affordable and it's also very warm and Leith loves bright colors like this he's always gravitated towards like bright yellows and mustards and so i grabbed that for him i discovered this brand called miles baby and they're a canadian brand and their stuff is just really beautiful um very amazing quality and i picked up some um what do you call these crew neck sweatshirts for him they're 95 percent cotton obviously five percent elastane but i grabbed three from their brand and um i mean i personally would say that they are when you think of kids clothes and not wanting to spend too much money on kids clothes i would say these guys are a bit more on the pricier side like their sweatshirts are like 40 dollars but um i picked up three they were having a sale and so i think i got them for like 20 or 19 dollars each which is still pretty good so i got this yellow and white one which i personally love it's very beautiful and then i got one in pink and i don't know i just love pink on babies this is more of like a muted pink like a dusty kind of pink color and then i got this in uh, black and white so i got these three from miles baby for him and i will link them down below i i'm like absolutely in love i feel like they're gonna be getting some more money from me very very soon we also have some other crew necks and these are thicker more like warmer ones that are better for like the warmer weather whereas this one is really good for like fall uh, you can layer them um, but we have this one here from roots and this is just their kind of classic uh, crew neck sweatshirt and i got them in actually quite a few colors so i think this one is called uh, charcoal mix and then this one is navy blazer pepper so this is more blue this one is gray and we picked up this one this one is it's it's quite large but i quite like it this one is this looks like a very kind of like vintage um look going on to it and this one they call it the flaxseed mix i feel like lathe grows very slowly <laughs> so this will fit him um but it's just kind of like a beige with pink as you can see, I really like pink. I picked up another pink item for him, but 
This one's really nice. I quite like oversized sweaters. I feel like they look really nice on and Lath can pull them off really well. Um, but you guys know I'm also a huge fan of oversized sweaters and I own quite a few myself. And you also know that I'm like, I love sweaters. Now I'm gonna move on to his shirts and uh, long sleeve shirts and like pocket shirts and stuff like that. I picked up quite a few of those. I'm gonna show you the polos first. So I have this gray polo. This one is from Zara. And it's just a plain gray polo shirt, long sleeve. And then I also got it in blue. And I got a short sleeve one from Old Navy in like a kind of like an ashier blue, I guess I would call this one. In terms of other long sleeve shirts, the Gap was having a friends and family event, so they were having 40% off plus an additional 10%. I picked up uh, some workout clothes for me because your mama started working out, and I picked up quite a few things for him as well. Gap, I find that they just have a lot of graphic t-shirts and stuff like that, and I really wanted Late's wardrobe to be very plain and very neutral. So I just picked up this plain, it's more of like a thermal, shirt but i thought it was really good to just kind of layer under sweaters and bigger t-shirts and so i just grabbed this one it's in gray and then i got uh, this long sleeve shirt from zara it just has a side pocket and two buttons here zara kids stuff is so cute and then i also got a matching one in anthracite it's like a gray black and these were really good price they were 5.90 uh, so I thought that was a really good deal and I bought two of them and then I got some other stuff from Old Navy So I just got this is what I was talking about when I say Old Navy is really good for basics if you're looking for Plain t-shirts. I highly recommend going to Old Navy These were about ten dollars each and they were having a sale So they rang up to about seven dollars, which is pretty good. So I got a long sleeve gray one and I also got a long sleeve black one. I don't know what this stuff is on his shirt. And a long sleeve blue, navy blue. I also got him a crew neck shirt, short sleeve gray. This is from uh, Old Navy as well. So all of these plain t-shirts that you're seeing is from Old Navy with the exception of one blue one, which I got from The Gap. Uh, but these plain ones are from Old Navy. So I got one in short sleeve gray, and then I got a v-neck one, short sleeve gray as well. And I got a pink one, a pink v-neck. I got this shirt from Zara. It's just a plain, it's like an off-white color with stars on it. So I got that one. And then last but not least, this one is from The Gap. This is just their plain blue crew neck shirt, but this one has a pocket. So I know a lot of the pieces might seem similar, but they're not really. Um, they're all very different and they were bought and purchased like with the idea in mind that these could be mixed and matched and layered. And I posted a picture on my Instagram showing you guys how I kind of like took inventory of all the stuff that I got for Lathe. And I just kind of laid them out in terms of how many of each item does he have. That way it will help me to see kind of like what I'm missing, what I need to purchase, what does he have too much of that I might not need to purchase and stuff like that. And it's really helped me to just kind of really put together, I find, um, a very kind of like simple but versatile wardrobe for him, which I think is very nice. Last but not least, I'm gonna show you the bottom. So these are all the joggers. So all I bought for him were joggers. Um, he has jeans, but he doesn't wear them very often. And he also has a couple uh, denim shorts, which we will be incorporating into his school wardrobe but I bought all joggers. Like I said, fall and winter are our coldest seasons. And so because that's those are also the longest, um, I did focus his wardrobe more on those seasons as opposed to summer since it's almost over. These two are from Miles Baby. Um, these joggers are meant to match with that um, that crew neck sweatshirt I showed you guys earlier. So I bought the matching set uh, just because like I said, mix and match, so he can wear these together, which would look really cool, or he can mix and match them, which is also very nice. 
So I got those and then I got a gray color with kind of like splashes of black on there, which is also really nice. This is from their Gap Fit line for kids, which is so, it's super cute. They're like little joggers, like athletic joggers for babies. And so I got uh, one in gray. I really like this. Like, I feel like I need this in a grown up version. And I also got it in black. I'm sorry guys, there's like cat hair all over this stuff and I got it in black as well. I got two from Zara as well, so I got a uh, light gray, I guess you would call this a heather gray color. I don't know why they put pockets on baby clothes, this makes no sense to me. But I got a heather gray and I also got it in a navy blue. And the last two joggers are from Roots. I purchased these with his sweatshirts. And so I got this color block one, green and blue. The reason, okay, the green is very random in the sea of other things that he has, but these were on sale. These were $14. And I don't know if you guys know this, but Roots can get quite pricey. So I picked this one up, it was 14 bucks. They had it in his size. I just kind of couldn't leave it behind. So I grabbed this one for him. And um, then I got just regular blue ones. These are so soft and these are so um, comfy. They have fleece on the inside, which makes them very warm. So he's gonna be wearing these um, like during the winter time. I just really want him to have really comfortable clothes that he can run and bend and nap in at preschool. So I picked up these hunter boots for him actually a few months back. Um, I just kind of saw them and I knew he wouldn't be wearing them anytime soon, but I just, I couldn't Funny enough, when we were in Paris, I came across a yellow raincoat. It was way too big for him. It was the only one there. And I just, I had to have it. And so I bought that yellow raincoat and I'm like, I'm gonna buy him yellow rain boots when we get back to Toronto. And so funny enough, when we got back to Toronto, I bought him the yellow rain boots, but I bought it for him this year. So his yellow raincoat is now perfectly his size. And so he can wear them with his yellow rain boots. And I feel like it's just gonna look super cute. And these are a bit big for him. So I purchased socks that one, he can wear in warmer weather. And two, these will definitely help to kind of just fill in um, the shoes a bit so that he doesn't have too much room wiggling around in there. But how cute are these? And he absolutely loves them. He loves yellows and oranges and like bright colors, which is, it's, it's quite different from what I like, but you know, he can have stylish, colorful stuff too. The last pair of shoes that I got for him were his indoor shoes. So he needs a pair of indoor shoes and outdoor shoes. And these are his indoor shoes. These are from Adidas. And I asked, um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, then I asked you guys what you thought um, of these shoes. And most of you actually picked another pair. But I'm really glad I went with these just because they're just really um, flexible and they just fit him really nicely. And he can put these on by himself whenever he feels like it. So that's that. I got these two jackets for him. So this denim one is from Zara and i don't know denim jacket now i want to get him a faux leather jacket i feel like that will just kind of complete the look so i'm really thinking about that and then i got this knit zip up one from zara as well i feel like this would be really nice to wear over polos or just plain t-shirts on the cooler days or cooler mornings and so i got these too that is it for this video i really hope you guys enjoyed the stuff that i picked out for him and if you do let me know in the comment section below but thank you guys so much for watching and i'll catch you later bye guys